Now there is a path going up, but I'm going to go down on the beach for a little while in a minute and um, have my cheese and tomato and a drink of juice. Camera's lasted quite well at the moment. I did give it an extra boost this morning and uh, yeah, I gave it an extra boost. So there we are, if we look back over the fields, there's Brent Knoll, Bleeding Hill, there's Uphill, you can't see Crook's Peak, there's all these green, I don't know if it's barley, I'm not quite sure what this plant is, I've got a feeling it's barley. It, didn't, it don't look like wheat, I think it's barley. And... Uh, I'm so glad this path is open, but it's only open for another three weeks, don't forget. So I've got to try and do this in reverse. Um, and then you've got to wait another year. You could probably come out and do so much of this. You've got the signs on the gates look very old, as if you've always been able to do it. But they do, they, you aren't allowed to do some of it because they lock the gates. Right, so maybe you're allowed to do a bit of it. You might be allowed to do a bit of it. But you can't walk along there and think you could get over because you've got that gully there. You've got that gully. How, how new does that look? Oh, I don't know. It does. It probably does look quite new. The pins aren't rusty or anything. Yeah, I reckon that's quite new now. They've um, opened it up to the public. Like I say, there's a little path that goes up into those trees and you can get up the top. <coughs> I don't know what the time is at the moment whether I want to do that or not. I don't know. Yeah, they'd lock all these gates when um, they don't want you to come in. Yeah, I saw a bloke I know, he looked, I told him about this walk and he did look a bit knackered. So if he'd done it and walked home, he would have been knackered by the time he got back. That was the day I was gonna do it. I got diverted on the bus to Burnham instead. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. We walk past the house. It says that, see, there's a sign there. Unsuitable. Yeah, let me take a picture right of that. Then. So here's the England Coastal Path. There's the Rain Down Farm. And uh, this will be locked to the public. Yeah, they used to have a, a ferry down here years ago, don't forget. The ferry used to be there and it used to go over to, um, well it went over there somewhere near Uphill. And this is Breen Down. It sticks out for miles everyone. And I've been up there, I, there's a path that weaves up, I can see it, I might, I might do it in a minute. I might do that. Just do a bit of the, of the down. But I did really want to go down there and have my sandwich but they might ban you now but never used to never used to ban you no I can see a path the River Axe Waterbird Refuge the muds and sands of the Axe Estuary team with food for waterbirds Redshank oh yeah that's the name of the bird 
Redshank often feed and rest in the creeks and inlets near here. Listen for the choo-choo warning call, which gives them their nickname, Sentinels of the Marsh. Yeah. But, um, now, how do I get down there? I mean, I do get down now. Oh, yeah, there you are. And there's the sign, look. England Coastal Path, 16th of April. Oh, it's the 15th of July. Oh, it's longer than I thought. Seven miles. England Coastal Path, Brain Down Fort. Oh, right. So it's, it's open to the 15th of July. That's good. There's um, Sand Bay over there. Not oh, Sand Bay. Um, Brent Knoll in the distance. Across the mist. Let me just turn off to take a picture. <laughs>